<laughs> Her daughter's getting married. How crazy, huh? You can't call yours Moochkins. Um, it's a different name. I can't get copyrighted. She's my teacher's assistant this year, which is nice. I yo. Ben's all excited. I was working on a video. Normally I edit at night, but we had some family things happen yesterday, so I wasn't able to. It's so I decided to do some this morning. It's huge. Wait, that's, that's huge. What, that's what was at the cabin. That's what was at the cabin then. Okay, 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 that's I'm coming. Green. Holy cow. <laughs> I got a shot of it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Look at you. There is a praying mantis in your window. I just Whoa. tried to close that. That's been freaked out. He was like, there's something huge in my window. Because there was. That's awesome. awesome. How do you get him? Hello. Does he need yeah. safe? No, be he'll be fine. He got up here on his own. He'll get out. Uh, or she. Able. You're not going to be able to get him. Is that what was at the cabin then? No. I don't know what that was at the cabin. <laughs> That's so cool. Hello. I've never seen that thing before. Neither have I. I was That's so neat. I tried huh? to close the blinds and I see that. What are you doing, T? Deep cleaning the dollhouse. Yeah, she she takes care of keeping the dollhouse out here clean for the kids. So when it starts Dusty. to look gnarly, <laughs> she attacks it with Q-tips and cleaner. Yep. It's looking yeah. nice. I use the Q-tips to get the order. Oh, nice. So it is a pretty laid back day here. It was supposed to be our first day of school. And um, we suffered another loss in our family. Um, the last time it was my uncle. Now it's Matt's uncle. So um, we lost Uncle Paul. We recently took you to his and Sue's wedding and that's who we lost in our family. So, um, and that happened yesterday. So it was supposed to be our getting ready for getting back into school, first day back to school, and we just, we did not do that. So tomorrow we will begin um, school. And so tonight is our night before school and I'm trying to get things ready, putting in some last minute grocery orders, but it was a very, is a very tough loss for the kids. This is, this is the first time for Aspen that someone super close to him has uh, passed away. So, anyway, that is what's going on on the home front. And um, now we're just trying to get some dishes done, some laundry done. The kids already had their back to school outfits picked out, so we don't have to worry about that. We're gonna pack lunches tonight, which is something new this year. Um, I've not had the kids pack lunches uh, during homeschooling, and this year I thought, you know what, maybe that would take a little bit of stress off the homeschool day, is by having the kids just pack cold lunches and not worrying about like cooking lunches. Um, some days though, if we have leftovers or something and that's what they'd like for their lunch, we'll just pop it in. So I think I might have showed you, but we're just using these little, um, this is what Matt uses for his weight loss journey is to like meal prep in these so we're using these for the kids as lunch boxes i was going to go out and buy them lunch boxes and lunch boxes were like ten dollars and i thought to myself why am i doing that when i can just use a meal prep thing it's got a microwavable dish so if they want to do something warm they can if they want to do something cold they can in it and i can just pop them in the dishwasher and i don't have to think about it instead of spending forty dollars on lunch sacks that we don't really need. They can keep their lunch cold in the refrigerator. So the the idea was kind of quaint for me, but the more I thought about it, the more, I'm sorry, I have something going on with my eye. The more I thought about it, the more I thought, you know what, it's really a senseless use of money. So, oh, I don't know what's going on with my eyeball. Anyway, I'm gonna get back to dishes and I think T's gonna finish cleaning that up. I've got some recycling to take out, our fish water. If you didn't know, we actually buy our ocean water for our salt water tank. It's, it comes out perfect pH for the fish, so um, it's a lot easier than adding and doing all these chemicals to our water here, so 
anyway, that is what's going on, and I'm gonna figure out why my eyeball is so itchy. Okay, so I was cleaning up the kitchen, decluttering stuff, because I'm trying to get ready for the school year, and I get this text message from Matt, and it says, come down here ASAP. So he's still working and I'm like, okay, that's weird. Like what's going on? Must be something really important. So I go down there and Charlie is on speakerphone and she's like, mom, dad, I'm getting married on Saturday. So <laughs> she wanted to have, she said she's always wanted to have a small wedding and her and Ryan have been talking about it for quite some time. And they decided they're going to, hit, they have a friend who's ordained and they're just gonna have a small ceremony in the park and they're getting married this Saturday. Now, that being said, they're getting married depending on what's going on with Uncle Paul's services and stuff like that. But, yeah, so <laughs> our daughter's getting married. How crazy, huh? And we're about to gain a son. And there's too many of them. Too many sons? Yeah. Yeah, you guys are kind of outnumbered, huh? Yeah, yeah, but just think, just think. When the boys start getting married, then we're gonna add daughters. I was the only one. <laughs> There's too many of them. I'm out. Yeah! <laughs> Are you excited Charlie's getting married? Oh my goodness, you're so silly. Okay, I had to show you what T created with the Play-Doh I just got the kids for school. <laughs> Isn't it cute? What are you making, Rhea? She's ripping me off and making a mushroom. This is actually a mushkin. It's a music. Yeah, I went there. I went there. Too. Copyright so, infringement. <laughs> she calls her little mushkins. creatures mushkins. You can't call yours mushkins. Um, it's a different name. I can't get copyrighted. <laughs> there was this toy brand. I think it. I'm pretty sure it was a successor to like it like brought in those dolls Rainbow High. Oh. But it was like poopsie slime. And they couldn't get copyright infringement because they classed it as a parody, but they'd have Doritos and it would like be Pooitos and then like Farta instead of Fanta. <laughs> you have been giving your sister a hard time all day today. Ow, mom, she hit me. She's not even next to you. Yeah, she is. Are you ready for the first day of school? I don't know. <laughs> I know. It's nice, huh? I am, however, making something for tea for tomorrow because she's my assistant teacher for like... I don't know if I have anything to do tomorrow. Um, no, not really. Maybe some art. We'll see what, what it lands tomorrow. But she's going to help teach art classes. Mom, yeah, I got my own little supplies to use. I did. And she's going to help with party planning, holiday planning, event planning for school. So she's my teacher's assistant yes. this year, which is nice. And right now I'm actually helping make tea. Mango! Um, mango, yeah, I'm cutting up. I bought some mangoes when I was at the store yesterday. I'm one of the only so kids good. in the house who likes them. Yeah, Aspen will eat them too. He just, small amounts. I did find out though I'm allergic to the skin. <laughs> yeah, she can't eat the skin. So anyway, I'm cutting up some mango to put in here. I cut one up today. And I'm going to cut this one up because these are very ripe. They're very ready to go. And she's going to have these with her lunch or snack or something tomorrow. I don't know. Whatever she decides to do with them. <laughs> on my Nutella sandwich. Oh, do you think or that'll be good? Together? Have to let me know. I bet it was strawberries. It would be good. <laughs> I'm going to finish kitchen cleanup because we had tacos. And you can see my stove. <laughs> it's disgusting. The kids already packed their lunches. I've got about a half an hour before I've got to get Aspen in the shower, get him settled down, and doing his nightly routine. Oh, it's a busy night tonight. Mm -hmm.